I want to also ask you about your relationship because you and Daryl are like so cute. You've like known, I feel like we, I wasn't really aware of you guys dating. I think until like, you know, engagement, Megan Trainer's getting married and it's like, yeah. And we're like, oh my God, Junie from Spy Kids? What, what's going, what's yeah, going on? Like, like we found out today that they're, they're they're married. Yeah, it's so yeah. funny. Did you? How many times did you watch Spy Kids as a kid? Because I feel like Spy Kids was, especially for our age, like when Spy oh. Kids 3 came out and it was like 3D and it was like the first 3D movie you could go to, Fire. it was next level fire yeah we were at the movie theaters every time that was like our movie i got spy kid toys for christmas i was a spy <laughs> like when we would play manhunt and like hide and seek we were like we're full spies like that was my whole childhood yep. and, um i'm it's a crazy thing though when i like started coming to la as a songwriter he and his friends crashed one of our like big songwriter parties we were throwing and I was like, oh my Christ, it's Spy Kids. <laughs> I freaked out. And he was at the drinks and I was like, so already there that I was like, I'm gonna go talk to him, I don't care. And I, I don't get starstruck. I don't embarrass myself that much, but I went up right up to him and was like, are you Spy Kids? And he was <laughs> like, yeah. And I was like, oh. I was like, I'm Megan, you're a hero. <laughs> and then all night that night, I was like, guys, watch this. Spy Kids, and he was like Megan, <laughs> and then two years later, I'm um, pop star Megan Trainer, and we we're set up on a date by Chloe Grace Moretz, and I was like, oh my god, I hope he doesn't remember me, and he claims he does remember me. Um, and what's also crazy is I wrote a love song called Hopeless Romantic that was like, I bet I already met you, and you're already at a party before, and you were sweet, and I just missed my chance, and so that was our song that he played while he proposed to me. Water I invisible. I just love this story so much because <laughs> if yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah this is a storybook like fairy tale wedding situation that we have got going on I honestly just love the fact that you brought up Spy Kids to him because when we were talking about you and pr preparing for this interview friend was like we got to talk about Junie from Spy Kids like we're like here where is he <laughs> we will get him just in case <laughs> And it's just, well, because also I was telling um, Rhea and our producer too, like ever since he posted the video of him dancing at your wedding, like I go back and watch that every so often because it's so good. It's so good. Are you an amazing dancer? Get over here. Hi. We got Spy Kids. Hello. <laughs> we were talking about Spy Kids. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so we grew up with that. Yeah. Thank First you. of yes. all, congrats. Oh my God. Thank yes. you. Thank you. So we excited. made a little spy kid. Yeah, a little <laughs> spy kid. Oh, maybe you can have another movie come out with your kid. I don't know. I feel like I'm pushing the limit here, but I'm just saying. No, like, what does he, what's he going to be? Gotta Wait, <laughs> want to do. wants to be an yeah. actor first and then. And tell him all the secrets. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Definitely. Yeah, meeting him in the beginning, he still had his gap because he got veneers now. But I, it was really tough to be like, oh, I'm making out with little Julie Cortez. Like, I had to, like, <laughs> Like he's 25, he's 25. Like, I don't know, it was weird, but it was cool. That is so, so LA, cool. LA changed you, you got the veneers? I, ma I made him get them. <laughs> I changed her to change me. I was like, because a lot of people when he was doing auditions, they're like, we just still see Juni Cortez. And I was like, bro, it's your gap. Love you and all you <laughs> And we were just dating. So people thought I was crazy because I was like, I'm gonna gift you these veneers. Like, let's get veneers. And they were like, but he's just your boyfriend. I was like, but if he ever leaves me, I'll pull them out. <laughs> was this is like this, yeah, this is me being like, you're mine, you know? Yeah, it was, so, it was planned. That's so funny because it is like when you're dating someone and it's like if there is a breakup and you kind of go back and give each other back your stuff to be like, hey, man, give me your teeth. <laughs> Yank them out. <laughs> All the time. I was like, you can't leave me now. What is it? Oh, my God. If you like and then you got to put a ring on it. Yes. So you did. Thing instead. I don't so know. My, dad, my dad jokes are coming, dad in, jokes are coming in strong right and it's now. I love it. Well, yeah. well Fran oh, wanted to talk yeah. about um the performance yeah, at the since, wedding. Since you're both right there. Yes. <laughs> since you're both right there, I've got to ask because I, me and my mom are obsessed with music and lyrics. Like I've watched the movie a billion yeah. times. So when I saw the video, it was it really performing up goes my heart right now. Like, is this real yeah. life? Like what is, was there a connection for them that movie with you guys? 
Yeah, we love it so much. Well, you introduced me to the movie. I was like, like, you don't know this movie? Get ready for the best music you've ever heard and the best love story ever. Um, we and- both bawled <laughs> our eyes out. And I was like, after uh, I proposed and she said yes, I had, uh, you know, like not that much time to get everything together. Because I knew I, was, I wanted to do something special. I also forced for the, him. For the wedding. She did. I again. said, I perform for you every day because he went on tour with me. I'm like, I give you a show. I'm not performing at my wedding, but you should perform for me. Because he also plays guitar and sings. So I was like, give me a show. It's my turn to sit back and relax and watch the show. He went above and beyond. I just, I love the <laughs> element of surprise. So like, we love music and lyrics. She loves it so much. And so I was just like taking notes. I'm like, okay, I gotta like do something with this song. It was um, all our favorite yeah. like love songs. Yeah. I love it. It was so great. That song is so great. Now, no, n- no Christmas out, al- no Christmas song for you guys? Christmas <laughs> song for us. What do you mean? I mean, I'm seeing backgrounds on. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah. Like, is, is, like, is, was he, in, what, did you have any, because I feel like you live together. You've been obviously doing uh, your, creating, you live together, you're married. You have this <laughs> um, Christmas album coming out. And I'm sure Daryl was there for the making of, of the album. <laughs> I was asking, like, any contribution? Yes, especially because I was pregnant the whole time. He was running, right. giving me food and water and singing backgrounds anytime I asked. Um, so he was were... your assistant a little bit. <laughs> yeah, I mean, lover just assistant. The, just, yeah, the nurse, the hydration the nurse, station. The, the make the sure you sit down because my feet are... I was, like, large at the end, too. And he was like, today's the first day I really saw your belly, like, while you were singing and, they, like, <laughs> you look pregnant and it's so cute. It's awesome. Oh, oh you guys are so you guys are so cute. cute. <laughs> Seriously, you guys are so cute. Yeah, a lot of couples like have struggled in quarantine, but like we're just grosser yeah. and closer. <laughs> grosser. Love it. <laughs> I know. I know it's true because people we've talked about that too. You know, uh, we are both in relationships. We both have boyfriends, but uh, people have asked us like, oh, God, have you gotten sick of each other yet? And like the funny answer is be like, oh, yeah, you're so annoying. But we're both like, oh, my God, we, we have our boyfriends so <laughs> much. <laughs> best. It's the best. That's why you like, like those are the cheesy things. We're like, you know, when you know, but that's <laughs> like if you lock me in a room with him for 24 hours, I'd be pumped. Yeah, like I yeah. wouldn't want to rip his face off, you know? Same. Right. Yeah. All the single people listening to this interview are going to want to <laughs> jump off a bridge. <laughs> They're going to be like, these They're people like, are oh, way too happy. <laughs> like if you're going to marry them, I don't know, like make sure they're your best friends. He's my yeah. best friend. Yeah, it's a, that's amazing. 